Now let us take few more examples of the languages. Assume the languages, languages set of all the strings which are palindromes, which are palindromes. Okay, fine, good. Over submission is equal to a comma b. The second language is a raised to power m, b raised to power n, c raised to power k, such that n is equal to n plus k. The third language is a raised to power n, b raised to power n, c raised to power l, such that l is equal to n plus n. And the fourth language is a raised to power n, b raised to power m, c raised to power k, such that n is less than or equal to 10 raised to power 10 raised to power 10. We can have a language which is a raised to power n, b raised to power n, such that n is less than or equal to 10 raised to power 10. Okay, fine. See, I've taken this example just to tell you that we can give finite automata for some or we can give regular expressions for some and we cannot give regular expressions for some languages. Because maybe some language can be regular or maybe some languages may not be regular at all. Okay, for example, let us say the first language is set of all strings which are palindromes. Set of all strings which are palindromes. So what are the palindrome strings? String of length 0 is a palindrome. We can have single A is a palindrome. We can have single B is a palindrome. We can have double A as a palindrome. We can have A, B, A as a palindrome. We can have A, B, B, A as palindrome. We can have A, B, A, B, A as a palindrome. We can have A, A, A as a palindrome. We can have A, 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 A and as a palindrome and so on. When I'm saying palindrome, palindrome is if you read the string from start or from the end in both the directions, you should be able to read the same string. Should be able to get the same string. For example, let us suppose we have English letter words like Nitin. N, I, T, I, N. Nitin. If, even if you read Nitin from this direction to that direction or even if you read Nitin from that direction to this direction, you can see Nitin is a palindrome. In the same way, if you have words like Malayalam, M-A-L-A-Y-A-L-A-M, Malayalam. If you read Malayalam from this direction to that direction or that direction to this direction, in both the cases, you are going to read the string as same. And in both the directions, Malayalam is represented the same. Right. So when I'm saying the strings are palindrome, that means we can have any combinations of A's and B's in such a way that even if you read the string from any of the directions, then, then you should be able to read the same strings. But for that purposes, you need to compare them. Compare them. When I'm saying comparison, that means like if here is N, then here it should be N. If the second one is I, so second one should be I. N, third can be there. Right here in this case, see M and M, A and A, L and L, A and A, and then we have Y. And then we have Y. Okay, so it says that when we have the strings which are palindrome, so there should be a comparison between the first symbol and the last symbol. There should be a comparison between the second symbol and the second last symbol, and so on. So that comparison is not at all possible with the finite automatas, right? So if that comparison is not at all possible with the finite automatas, therefore you cannot draw a finite automata for such palindrome strings. But if we say we fix the length of the string, then it may be possible. But right now, if the length of the string can be infinite, so for this language, finite automata is not possible. And if finite automata is not possible, therefore the language is not regular. And if the language is not regular, therefore the regular expression is not possible. And regular expression is not possible or you can say language is not regular, therefore regular grammar is also not possible. So for this you cannot give a regular expression. Got it? Yes. Take the next example. Here we have a raised to power m, b raised to power n, c raised to power k, where m is equal to n plus k. 
m is equal to n plus k that means length of a should be equivalent to the length of b and c but is there any way where you can compare the uh, length of a with length of b and c no in case of finite automatas if the string length can be infinite you cannot do it for this language you cannot make a finite automata and because you cannot make a finite automata therefore for this language regular expression is not possible okay another language is a raised power n b raised power n c raised power l where a and b should be exactly the same and this is infinite language right so for this finite automata is not possible therefore you cannot make a regular expression now here you can see a raised to power n b raised to power m c raised to power k where n comma m comma k you can say n comma m comma k which should be less than or equal to 10 raised to power 10 raised to power 10 for this finite automata is possible and it will be containing very large number of states but still there is a finite automata which will be possible therefore for this language you can give a regular expression but that giving that regular expression or writing that regular expression will take you ages to take ages for you to write that regular expression but it is possible to give regular expression for this language okay now here you can see a raised to power n b raised to power n such that n is less than or equal to 10 for this finite automata is possible therefore regular expression is also possible but if the string is a raised to power n b raised to power n such that n is greater than or equal to 10 for this neither finite automata is possible nor regular expression the difference is here it is less than or equal to and here it is greater than or equal to it makes the length of the string as finite if the string is finite if all the possible strings the maximum length can also be finite then you can give regular expression you can make finite automata because finite automata itself is containing the word which is finite finite means strings length of the string should be finite but if the length of the string is infinite and there is a comparison between the lengths then maybe at some cases you may not be able to create a finite automata so those languages are not regular for those languages you cannot draw up you cannot write a regular expression now let us see if you can uh, if you can you know uh, if you can you know uh, convert a regular expression with the fine uh, to a finite automata or a finite automata to a regular expression okay